Do you get more emotional about the things that anime characters go through rather than series brought to you by different productions? If yes, then chances are you have your own list of the most emotional scenes in all of your favorite animes. But your emotions are not only caused by tear-jerking scenes. Welcome to The Bestest, the channel that provides you the bestest news and videos you should know about. In today's episode, we'll discuss the most epic anime fight scenes yet. Before we start, please make sure to like and subscribe to our channel and hit the bell to get notifications of our videos. We all know that the bestest can serve you a platter filled with everything you have yet to find out. And that includes the bestest in anime. Some of you have grown alongside anime characters like Naruto, Luffy, or maybe even Conan. However, there are others who may have stumbled upon this episode to get a short gist of why people watch these highly acclaimed anime. Don't worry. Aside from adding more anime to your watch list, we are here to give you a short glimpse of what to expect from them. More specifically, we'll be dishing out the most epic anime fight scenes so far. In number 10, we have Naruto Uzumaki and Sasuke Uchiha from Naruto Shippuden. Most of you are familiar with these characters, and for some who aren't, we suggest for you to get on your favorite streaming platform and start binging. Seeing that they are both ninjas and members of Team 7 under the leadership of Kakashi Hataki, you may not have expected them to reach this point of their complicated relationship as friends. This is among the most awaited fights in anime history as this is one that's constantly being hyped up as the whole plot progresses. Starting out as rivals, both grew together and gradually grew apart. Both being mentored by legendary Sanins, Jiraiya, and Orochimaru, who could expect that these ninjas both had the power to protect Konoha village? At the end of the Fourth Great Ninja War, where both ninjas fought against Madara and Kaguya, they came to the conclusion of now starting the real fight between them. If you are among the avid followers of the anime, you would be thrilled to see how they fought in the Valley of the End, which was the same place Madara and the first Hokage, Hashirama, had their final battle as well. Shadow clones were everywhere. A brutal exchange of ninjutsu, ninja stars, kunai knives was followed by the clash of Ransengan and Chidori on the Amaterasu scorch earth. This ended in a brawl using bare hands where both Naruto and Sasuke lost an arm. Some may argue, but this served as a satisfying end to their rivalry. Not a lot would admit that this scene contained a lot of emotions, but a few people would deny shedding a few tears of joy. Were you amazed? If you were then, we suggest you get started on watching Naruto. But you should definitely stay since there are still a lot of anime you could discover by watching this episode. At number 9, we have Ichigo Kurosaki and Ilkura Cypher from Bleach. This anime is among the most interesting and the very first shonen anime in history. The substitute Soul Reaper, Ichigo Kurosaki, ended up coming to Hueco Mundo to save his friend Inoue Orihime. And whoever said that this wasn't a perilous journey for the Soul Reaper? As he arrived in Hueco Mundo, he began to face one adversary after the other. His friends, the Quincy, Ishida Uryo, the Fullbringer, Saito Yusutora, and Soul Reapers Rukiya Kichiki and Renji Abarai also face different and stronger adversaries the same way Ichigo does. Elkiora's resurrection form manages to kill Ichigo. The substitute Soul Reaper has undergone full holification, but somehow unconsciously. He defeats Okura in an instant, which almost led to him killing him, but is stopped by Ishida. This is among the most epic battles in anime history. Ichigo's battle against Okura definitely tops his battle against Aizen Sasuke. At number 8, we have Midoriya, Izuku, and Todoroki Shoto from Boku no Hero Academia. Despite being an ongoing anime, Boku no Hero Academia surely gave audiences a new superhero to fawn over. 
Among the new animes that have been released, Boku no Hero Academia has the most number of fans so far. And the fight between Midoriya Izuku and Todoroki Shoto is just one reason why more fans gather to support the anime. As it happened during the UA Sports Festival's fighting tournament, we obviously had seen it coming. What we didn't expect would be how Midoriya now has more control over his own powers, along with Todoroki's history and the reason behind not using his pyrokinesis powers. Both kids have powerful quirks, and in this fight, we've managed to sneak a peek into the future on how strong they can be. For those who haven't started or haven't reached this part in the anime, there are a few spoilers ahead. This ends in Todoroki unleashing his pyrokinesis quirks as a result of becoming more motivated by Midoriya's encouragement. The fight concludes in Midoriya's defeat, but to him, it felt like he won since he did manage to get Todoroki to use his pyrokinesis quirk. At number 7, we have Akira Fudo and Ryu Asuka from Devilman Crybaby. This anime is by far one of the most interesting and surreal animations we have ever witnessed. Best friends, Akira and Ryu, ended up fighting each other to the death. What started out as a calm, fresh, and relaxed anime ends up in a terribly dark manner. Akira ended up being possessed at a party by a demon. He went through obvious changes that started with his height, build, and sudden increase in his physical capabilities. This adventure deepened when he found more human beings just like him. These are the people who became capable of controlling the devils within them, further utilizing their powers. Unfortunately for Akira, his best friend Ryu is the human manifestation of Satan, whose goal is humanity's destruction. That was the argument that started a war between devilmen who wanted to save humanity from devils under Ryu's influence. This anime only has a few episodes and we highly recommend you to watch it. At number 6, we have Saitama and Boros from One Punch Man. Believe it or not, Saitama has become a beloved superhero figure for fans everywhere. This superhero anime seems like a parody of all sorts at first glance, but once you see how the story progresses, you'll come to know and love Saitama and how he packs such power in one punch. Following the anime, Saitama becomes powerful due to his own personal intensive training, which was also the reason why he's bald. A deciding moment in this anime series was the fight between Saitama and Boros. This was the fight that served as a satisfying ending to the anime's first season. Ever since the pilot episode, Saitama has already been revered as an unbeatable hero. Fans everywhere held onto the edge of their seats, fully believing that Saitama had finally met his match when Boros came to Earth. Well, Saitama managed to defeat the alien invader, but the hero story doesn't end there since there are still more in store for Saitama in Season 2. At number 5, we have a classic scene from Cowboy Bebop featuring a fight between Spike Spiegel and Vicious. If you ask your friends for anime recommendations, they're bound to mention Cowboy Bebop. This anime is one that stays in the Hall of Fame. One reason will be the fight between Spike and Vicious. They fought it out with a pistol and a sword. It may seem very unconventional, but that's what makes this fight epic. The death of the woman that both of them love sparks the last fight. Spike storms the crime syndicate's headquarters and ends up fighting Vicious to the death. This was an iconic scene in anime history, which made a lot of people feel a mix of different emotions. Yes, it was an epic fight. Everything we've mentioned so far were epic scenes from popular animes, but these fights weren't just epic. Following the character's story and knowing how firm they are in keeping and believing their principles is just another reason why even epic anime fights like this makes you feel a lot of different emotions at the same time. But this episode isn't over yet. <laughs> Are you excited to know what the most epic anime fight is yet? Well, getting back to the countdown. 
At number four, we have Jotaro Kujo and Dio Brando from JoJo's Bizarre Adventures. This anime has been highly consistent in giving viewers the best fight scenes in anime history. However, in all the fights that happen in JoJo's Bizarre Adventures, Jotaro Kujo and Dio Brando's fight takes the cake. After losing to Kakyuin, Jotaro made sure that Star Platinum evolved to an even higher level than Dio's The World. This clash between two powerful people was not only ferocious, but it also showed the great intensity of Stan's power. Even when Dio came across as someone who's unbeatable, Jotaro found a way to do the impossible. The fight has been decided the moment Jotaro's own time-stopping ability was awakened in the middle of their epic battle. At number 3, we have Goku and Jiren from Dragon Ball Super. Some people may have expected an appearance from Goku and Frieza, but Goku's fight with Jiren was definitely an underrated battle. As Goku enters the Tournament of Power, he comes face-to-face -face with Jiren. The tournament requires each universe representative to fight against the biggest, baddest fighters from all over the multiverse. It would seem like a harmless battle, but losing universe representatives will have their universe erased from existence. This fight almost ended in Goku's defeat. But unfortunately for Jiren, our Super Saiyan hero managed to master Ultimate Instinct which immediately swept Jiren aside. This led to Jiren's elimination from the tournament. Dragon Ball Super is definitely a must-add to your watch list. At number 2, we have Mob and Kuyama from Mob Psycho 100. We can clearly see the art style from One Punch Man since Mob Psycho is another brilliant creation from manga artist One. The fight scene between Shigeo Kageyama or Mob and Megumu Kuyama won Best Fight Scene at the 2016 Crunchyroll Anime Awards. The anime follows the story of an average middle school kid called Mob trying to suppress his psychic powers. Mob wants a normal life, but because he has psychic powers and is constantly meeting people who also have their own psychic powers, he has no other choice but to go all out. Things get a lot crazy the moment he does. Mob reached 100% animosity by going after his brother and ended up grabbing Koyama by the face. He took him several hundred feet into the air and then brought him back to Earth resulting in a huge crater and loud thud. Mob is unlike all the protagonists you've met so far. As someone who's constantly surrounded by trouble despite doing all in his power to keep out of it, he has a poker face that will make you see a bit of Saitama in him. Take all the time you need to absorb all the information about the most epic anime fight scenes ever seen in anime history. There are a lot of animes which provide you with a consistent flow of seemingly endless battles. And that's not all. Animes like One Piece and Fairy Tale also give you a taste of a series of different battles. Although the plots of these anime revolve more on growth and friendship, these are still great animes that you should be watching. Now that we're nearing the end of this episode, do you have any idea what the most epic anime fight is? Ladies and gentlemen, uh, let's get ready to rumble! Well, at number one, we have Naruto Azumaki and Sasuke Uchiha against Momoshiki Otsusuki in Boruto. Boruto may not be as popular as Naruto was, but it does have its own epic battles to present. The powerful duo that follows the footsteps of their legendary mentors, Naruto and Sasuke, clashes against Momoshiki Otsusuki. We know we haven't seen enough of the Otsusuki clan at Kaguya's defeat in Naruto's Shippuden, but seeing Naruto and Sasuke team up against a celestial being brings about a certain nostalgia. As these ninjas prove to be more powerful than before, an excellent exchange of powers, fists, and ninjutsu was seen by everyone. A lot may hate on Boruto, but you have to be excited about seeing Naruto characters grow even more powerful at a significant rate. Plus, wouldn't you want to see more of Sasuke? 
That's about it for the most epic anime fight scenes the bestest has prepared for you. Oh no, God! No, God, please, no! 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 There are still a lot of animes for you to watch and look out for, but for now, let's talk about what your favorite anime fight scene is. Let us know in the comment section below, as we might just make a part 2 video. Make sure to like and subscribe to The Bestest and hit the bell to access more of our videos. Thank you so much for watching and until our next Bestest video.